my makeup routine. My sister actually just gave me my birthday present. Look how cute, Cooper. <laughs> These are the colors we're gonna do. Go for it. Hello everybody. Happy Friday. It's Friday, it's Friday, it's Friday. We've made it. I just pinched my finger so bad. So I haven't vlogged anything today. It's Friday like I mentioned. It's like almost 2.30 and I didn't film anything because you guys saw my morning yesterday and it was kind of like one of those days since I'm going to watch my little sister with my older sister at my mom's house tonight. Um, I kind of just had to like focus in on work and I don't know, all of that. So I wanted to turn on the vlog and vlog the rest of the night and my makeup routine because I'm gonna take off my ring for this actually because I know I had a couple comments asking about my travel uh, makeup routine and you guys really wanted to see it. I said I was gonna film it um, this week when we were in Portland, but I didn't. <laughs> I just ran out of time and I don't know. I just figured I could do it when I get home because it's basically the same thing. So nothing is really different. Um, but I love that you guys asked to see it because I love sharing whatever you guys want to see. So it's really nothing different. It's really fast and super simple. So this will be quick, but I thought we could just chat through it. Um, so I just did my tanning jobs actually. I did them this morning, so I don't really look tan yet, but tomorrow I'll be tan. But so I do that a lot, um, probably like once or twice a week, I'll do my tanning jobs and those help a ton. They just give like the perfect natural glow to my skin and I just love them. Those are from Ulta, so everything that I mentioned will be linked down below. But I'm pretty sure the star of the show um, in terms of like my glowy makeup is this L'Oreal Paris True Match Lumi Glotion. So I don't know if it's gonna focus, but I've shared about this before actually, and I've done like an IGTV video about my makeup and I love this stuff. So I don't really use it as a primer just because it's not really a primer. I just use it for like a under my foundation glow, basically. Um, so I love it. I'm obsessed with it. I feel like it works so well underneath my foundation and it just like, hopefully you guys are gonna be able to see. But it just gives like, look at that. It gives the most perfect sheen. It's so stunning. So anyway, um, that's what I do. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure that's uh, what you guys are seeing is like a glow. Of course I use like highlighter, highlighter. I use highlighter um, on top of my foundation and all of that, but I think this is like the main thing. It's just, oh my God, it's stunning. I just can always count on that to have my back. So then for the rest of the face, it's pretty easy. I just conceal a little bit with this Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and I have a few um, healing breakouts, which is nice. Um, so I just kind of cover those up a little bit. I really don't go heavy anymore. I know I've talked about this in the past before. I used to wear so much makeup and not like so much as if that's bad. Um, but it was just like, I don't know. It was just a time in my life when I like felt I always needed liner and a bunch of shadow, which I think some days I still do when it's like a fun event or something like that, but haven't been to one of those <laughs> in a while. Um, for the most part, I just love like a glowy natural face. So I just put it a little bit everywhere and as you can see like it kind of barely works <laughs> honestly I need a new one it's like running out so maybe that's why but and at the same time like I mean I'm going to my family so it's not like I'm being super like picky and when I'm with Sebastian like I don't know like I don't he prefers me to not have like a ton of makeup on and I prefer that too because it's like I don't know we're like traveling we're always on top of each other like and I don't know like being silly and stuff and you don't want to have like I hate when he like comes to kiss me and I'm like, oh, don't touch my face, don't touch my face. You know those days when your face is just like beat and perfect and you feel like you can't like interact with your partner, I don't know. So anyway, um, I guess that's kind of why I'm like more light coverage, but so I just do a little foundation. The foundation that I'm using is the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation and I've used this for a while and I really love it. It's not like my favorite foundation of all time but it's good so I just use a tiny bit of that to help even out my skin tone and as you guys will see like the um 
little glow i don't really know what it's called the glotion um still seeps through underneath this makeup if that makes sense so i don't use anything that's too heavy that like blocks it um it's still able to like peek through and be nice and glowy so i just use a little bit i feel like it gives me the coverage that i want and um i don't know it's really easy and nice and that is my foundation done so it's super easy and quick maybe i can show you here um i'm looking a little <laughs> washed out but um yeah as you can still see like on my cheeks like it's still nice and glowy so moving on the next little thing that i do that actually is pretty new um it's this hourglass ambient powder and it has like the tiniest little sheen to it which again i feel like helps um i wouldn't normally put a powder on my skin when i'm trying to like be glowy but this one's nice because it has like that sheen to it so i feel like it helps i just do the tiniest little bit all over and i've really been loving it so I just do a tiny bit and i feel like it helps um add like the glow and everything and then moving on all of this stuff is pretty much new so for um, bronzer i'm using the wet and wild sunset sunset strip tease so as you guys can see i really love this and um this is exactly what i used on vacation i wear it every single day it's just like a perfect neutral bronzer like not too red not too gray um or like cool tones so I really love it for my skin tone and when like my tanning drops like really shine through it just works so perfectly with my tan so today it's just like a tiny bit off since it's still developing but gives me a little bit of life and that's why I love bronzer so much and then for blush um, I'm still stuck on this I can't get off of the Milani baked blush in luminoso it has like the prettiest little sheen to it as well um, and it's just like the perfect everyday blush so i don't know i have a, like a few that i've been wanting to try i have the kylie cosmetics one that i used for a couple weeks and i loved it and then for some reason i just keep going back to this one so i just really like how it applies and i do a little bit extra because blush like falls off my face so fast so that is blush and then for highlighter actually i normally have been using the where is it the Jaclyn Hill Cosmetics or Jaclyn Cosmetics little palette here. But when I was on vacation, I didn't want to bring this clunky thing. So I was like, oh, I'll just bring a tiny little one. And this is the Mary Luminizer and it is amazing. So I've actually like used this in the past before, like years and years ago. And my sister gave me a ton of highlighters that she just doesn't use anymore. And this was one of them. And I was like, oh, I forgot how much I loved it. And I love it it's just like the perfect glow i'll show you guys in the sun but just the perfect glow and it's really easy and simple and it's just like a nice pretty color so that's what i've been using instead of the jacqueline i really still love the jacqueline hill um ones but look at that i just think it's so pretty and it's very subtle but like nice and healthy and glowy so that's what i've been using um and that's my face that is literally all I do for my face. I was gonna put my bronzer away, but because this is a travel makeup routine, I'm gonna show you how I did my eyes. So I wanted to keep all of my makeup super easy and simple so we could get out the door fast. So instead of bringing a eyeshadow palette or I don't know, just fluffing around with that, I found myself just using my bronzer. So I'm gonna pick up a fluffy brush and I just put the tiniest bit into my crease because it also just helps add a little definition to your eye, but also like, it's like you know it's there, but you don't, if that makes sense. Like it just kind of like blends into the rest of my skin. And so I really love this trick. So if you're low on eyeshadow and just want something quick and fast, I'm telling you, use your bronzer. It's just like the easiest little trick. Why do I feel like that's not the brush? I knew it. I could tell that was not my brush. This is my favorite brush. We all have our favorite. Yep, feels right. So I don't like mess around too much with it. And then if I'm feeling super fancy, which today I guess I am, I'll dip my finger into the highlighter and put this like on the inner corner and like towards like the center of the lid. And it just adds 
I don't know, I just feel like because I'm using the same products throughout my entire face, just helping everything like be very cohesive and just blend really well together. So really easy and takes no time at all, but that is my makeup. So those are my eyes. Um, oh my gosh, <gasps> the biggest chunk just fell out. So I'm gonna move on to my eyes and my mascara I use the same thing that I've used like for a year it is the I love extreme essence mascara so I use that and then for my brows I just use the Maybelline ultra brow pencil um, so I'm gonna do that really quickly off camera because it's boring and nobody really cares um, and then we will show the finished look when it's all done okay so there is the makeup done. It's super easy and super fast. Usually like when I'm not talking to you guys, it takes me like five minutes maybe. Um, so that's the makeup and I'll have everything linked down below if you would like to shop it for yourself. And hopefully you enjoyed this. Hopefully that was helpful and it answered your questions of what I use and things that I love. I did put on a lip, um, which is kind of new. I don't, I always use the Ulta Beauty Barely There lipstick that's like my go-to every single day but that's downstairs i'm too lazy so i did switch it up and i'm using this i think this is okay so this is l'oreal it's like the j-lo collection i actually wore this on my wedding the um girl who did my makeup katie i love her so much she actually gave this to me as like a little wedding gift so i'm wearing that and then i just have the tiniest bit of this revolution gloss on and i love it so it's the pout bomb and that's on my lips so yeah now i'm all ready for the day and um like i mentioned i'm going to leave for my mom's in like 20 25 minutes um we are watching my little sister me and my older sister so that'll be fun to hang out with them while my mom is working and then i'm gonna sleep over there just because it is kind of a longer drive for me and um i don't know i just think it'd be fun and so sebastian's going to be here and then tomorrow actually well all weekend we got ourselves a puppy actually we got three so we're watching um my sister-in-law's dogs for the weekend so they're heading off so we're gonna be at their house and dog sitting so tomorrow we're gonna do all the fun things that we've always wanted to do with the dog so we're gonna i don't know <laughs> take him to the park they have three dogs but two of them are like older and can kind of just like chill at home and then they have um the youngest luca and he is a little puppy he's not little anymore which is a bummer we and Sebastian were like we haven't seen him in a while and so I really still wanted him to be a puppy but he's not he still is but like a tiny little one um and so he like needs more attention so that's why we're gonna take him out a little bit and take him for a drive so anyway I think that will be fun so I'm gonna head back here in the morning so it'll be a quick little sleepover but I'm excited to see my sisters um I think I'm gonna have my little sister tie-dye this she is tie-dye queen and so I kind of want her to um bleach tie-dye this Chicago shirt it's like super um it's like a few years old so it's kind of faded and so it's kind of like on its way out so I figured it'd be fun for her to tie-dye so I might go into my closet and see um I have this like light blue crew neck um that I also think I want her to tie-dye so I'm putting her to work but anyway i will see you guys a little bit later when i'm getting ready to head to my mom's i'm here at my sister's house well, my mom's house then plating out for spaghetti we're eating spaghetti we're gonna watch a movie but my sister actually just gave me my birthday present and i wanted to open it for you guys do you want me to get your address <laughs> just kidding oh, yeah. <laughs> look at this this is so cute. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Nen, I'm so excited. So my sister got me the Chanel, beautiful Chanel bronzer that I've been wanting for such a long time. So I'm so excited to dip into this, give it a try. Thank you, Nen. We're starting our game of hide and seek. What? We should, we should have her have the camera and then like you, you we can see Document where she, it? she looks okay are we ready count to 10 no at least 15 Three, 
30? 30? I can't count that No, high. do 15. No, I am counting. No. I, I was hiding. Or, no, Nen is. I'm the senior. You're hiding. She's finding us. Let's look in the trash, because that's where Carly belongs. Where are they? Oh my god, I'm so scared. <laughs> oh my god! That scared the crap out of me. <laughs> you did it so abruptly! I, know, well, I wanted to like. <laughs> my I god! I don't know where Cassidy went, genuinely. No. Okay, I literally looked everywhere. I don't think you have. Why? Because, you know. Yeah! Hey, you why'd you come out? out? You got scared. Yeah. <laughs> you got scared. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. Me and Cooper are just waiting <laughs> to find the girls. Look at you, Cooper. He's very scared. Cooper, don't cheat and find them. Doodles. <laughs> gotcha. For some reason, I feel like Nen would be good. <gasps> oh my! Are your legs burning? Yes. Oh my god, that was I thought you were behind the door. No, I checked in here. Did you not see me? I did not see you. Oh, they're like, like, she's gonna find me. <gasps> no. Go right there, go, go behind it. I wanna see how it looks. Oh. It was hard because you have all black. Oh, I'm I guess sorry. I okay. And your socks are black. Yeah. Oh my god, that was so good. Hold on. Wow. Like, <laughs> Her feet. You well, you're oh, wearing I'm socks. Oh, I'm surprised you missed that. Yeah. I, yeah. If if I had socks, it'd be really good. Cooper was like running, and I was like, I, I'm scared. One of them was gonna like jump scare me. Then <laughs> or Carly, oh, you can see me. Yeah. I thought I was tiny enough to fit in this crack. <laughs> Is she behind the pillows? She's but. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> my sister's about to tie dye my Chicago shirt like I showed you guys, but how cute is this one that she made? Oh wait, you can't you can't really see it. Look at how cute. Yeah, I love it. And it's, she cropped it. My little artiste. Okay, yes. Will you please do it for me? Yes. Thank you. Okay, get to work. There's ice cream. My Woo! My shirt is currently being constructed. <gasps> this is your workstation. Oh my god, I'm so excited for it. I wish it would show something, but oh, <gasps> it is. It's doing it. I hope it looks Do just. Not touch it. Okay. Ooh, it smells <laughs> like bleach, baby. I hope it looks just like this one. If not, I'm giving you that shirt. <laughs> but this is such a fun way to like spruce up old teas, huh? I'm just. Living the dream, letting Cassidy do whatever she wants. She's tie dyed two of my clothes and now she's giving me a fake scar. <laughs> my talented little artist. We just finished the designs and we did some horror film recording. This is my, is this a cut? Yeah, this is a bruise cut, right? Sure. Okay. Yeah. I want mine in the same. It's a one of a kind. Who would have thought we would be doing this on a Friday night? Only Cassidy. Me and McKenna were not like this as children. I know. Well, I'm not a crafty person. No. <laughs> so now Cassidy's just giving us scars. We finished up the um, scar making, and now Cassidy wants to play salon in a pandemic. <laughs> so I guess it's not really a pandemic. I guess they always wear masks, but she's going to give you a manicure. <laughs> These are the colors we're going to do. Go for it. Do you think they look good? Look how cute. Thank you, doodles. I love them. Smile. Comment down below if she'd be a good mom. <laughs> oh my god, I would. The two rising teams. We have had the best time hanging out. We're actually watching The Last Dance. It's the second time I've watched it. My sister hasn't watched it, so Cassidy, my little sister, is not loving that we're watching it, but I'm letting her do all of the fun things to keep her entertained. So I thought I would just end the vlog here. Um, 
it's been a pretty eventful night and so hopefully you guys enjoyed it it was fun to share um my sisters with you guys especially cassidy she's so funny when the camera comes out she wants to vlog and she wants to try it like it's just so funny to see i don't know youtube through her eyes so i'm sure you guys got a lot of random clips so anyway i hope that you enjoyed give it a thumbs up if you did i would love it and appreciate it if you subscribed as well and i will see you guys in the morning bye